Polk County teacher suffers a near deadly fall in a room full of students. New tonight, Sheriff Grady Judd calling one brave boy a tiny hero. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith with the life saving actions tonight. Max Mesa is a six year old always on the move, which came in handy last month in class. He did it. He saved another person. It was only the second week of school here at Frostproof Elementary. Max's substitute teacher collapsed. She cracked her head. He wasted no time jumping into action, racing to a nearby classroom to get life-saving help. You know, my heart dropped whenever I found out because, you know, a six-year-old saving an older woman's life. So for me, it was very, very exciting and proud, you know, to be his mom. Joy Starr was on life support for nearly two weeks. Her family credits Max with saving the longtime educator, calling him their tiny hero. You stepped up to the plate. You, you're the real MVP. You're the most valuable player of this incident here. You saved her life. And we need more people like you in this world today. This week, Dar's son Derek met Max at Lakeland Regional Hospital, giving him his first pair of Air Jordans. He loved them. He thanked me. He hugged me. Um, I hugged him probably 20 more times and, and thanked him another 100 more times. That's yours for doing good. Is that pretty cool, everyone? The recognition didn't stop there. Polk Sheriff Grady Judd recently presented Max with a brand new bicycle. Little Max, I owe you, buddy. You're, you're family now, man. You're family. You're family, buddy. Little Max may not say much. They called you a hero. Are you a hero, Max? Well, then can I call me a hero? But his actions speak louder than words. He's my baby, so he's always been my hero. Now for everybody else. Superhero. In Polk County, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.